Blessed and happy Wednesday to all of you, my dear friends, my dear brothers and sisters, my dear good people of God, faithful followers of the Daily Gospel Reflection with Father Jack. My dear Kababayans, today is February 7, 2024, and today is Wednesday within the fifth week in Ordinary Time, Year B. Our Gospel for today is from the beautiful and the wonderful account of the Gospel of Mark, chapter 7, verses 14 to 23. Our gospel for today speaks about sanitary concerns, ritual purity. It is the continuation of the yesterday's gospel, the issue about the washing of hands. And in today's gospel, Jesus said, There is nothing outside a person that by going in can defile but the things that comes out. Meaning to say, moral cleanliness is more important than ritual purity. Because when you speak about defilement, defilement is spiritual and moral concerns, not physical agenda. God is concerned with the state of our heart. God is looking after the purity and the sincerity of our heart. The heart of the problem is the heart. Meaning to say, what I'm trying to drive at is this. It is not the food that makes us dirty it is not the food that makes us sinful the problem is not the stomach but the problem is the heart that's why jesus said there is nothing outside of us that by going in can defile us but the things that comes out so my dear friends my dear brothers and sisters the problem is not the stomach but the heart because evil or wickedness or sin begins in the heart and eventually it leads us to to action what we eat may make us dirty but it won't make us a sinner right the food may not be healthy but it won't make us unholy because food has nothing to do with our holiness. And now, what makes us dirty? And the gospel for today tells us something that makes us not clean. Fornication, murder, adultery, theft, wickedness, envy, slander, pride, you know, swearing, vices, stealing, Bad habits, you know, are, are addictions. That's why when, when you have an illicit affair with someone, it makes you dirty because unfaithfulness is a dirty activity. All these evil things that comes from, from within is what that defiles a person. That's why the invitation is let us check our inner self. What inside us that makes us dirty. And what's the challenge? What do we need to do? We need internal cleansing. You know, remove anything inside of us that destroy the beauty of our life. We need to watch our diet more than we, we watch our, I mean, we need to watch our heart more than we, we watch our diet. But the friends, what's eating you from the inside? What is inside of you that destroying the beauty of your life? We need to have internal cleansing. But the good news is this. We may not be pure. We, we may not be clean. We may be dirty. Perhaps there are things that defiles us. But the good news is, we have a God who can clean us. We have a God who can make us pure again. Come to Jesus and tell Him, change my heart, O oh God. If you love and like this reflection, kindly share it with your friends, share it with your family, so that many will be blessed. Amen.